but we still have a lot of things on our bucket list. Yes, we do. Stephen Hawks. And Stephanie Hawks. We started off doing the typical family travel, you know, Disney World, beaches. What better way to grow back together as a family than to just chuck it all? We sold our house. And, yeah. We sold our cars and we took off for a year. New Zealand, Malaysia, Sri Lanka, South Africa, Namibia, Tanzania. We love animals, we love nature. Everybody at home was like, what are you doing? Why are you doing that? Are you crazy? Have you lost your mind? Don't you need to you know, have your kids in school? And what we realized was there are so many things you can do when you're just traveling without yeah. somebody telling you where you have to go. Currently, we own a 2020 Newmar Dutch Star 4020. We were in the market, have a diesel, that was one of my things, and I wanted a tag axle because that provides more stability, and I needed bunks, and that's how we got into Newmar. At the time, that was in 2015, Newmar was the only one in the industry to have a diesel pusher with, with bunk bus. beds. And we loved it. We loved the RV lifestyle. And that's kind of what we were trying to figure out. Since we had the original <laughs> Dutch Star, we named him Dutch. We named him Dutch and loved him dearly. So I we cried when we let when we sold him. That's right, we did. We couldn't name him Dutch, so we went with Dutch Junior. Because he's shorter. And because he's the second generation for us. I have gotten into off-roading a little bit. Here are these trails that will show you what your Jeep can do. And I want to do as many of those things as I can. And he's very goal-oriented. Like, we can't just get one Jeep trail. We need to get them all. I want to do the things that present challenges to us. Hell's Revenge is, is characterized by the ups and downs. I think it would probably be better characterized as a really scary roller coaster with the chance of death. It is an enormous amount of fun. And it is beautiful. But the other thing is you get to know what you're capable of personally and what your rig is capable of. So our goal is to see the national parks. And we're about but, halfway through? Yeah. To have a favorite place, I have, for me, would be to say one's better than the other. And they're just all so different and all so beautiful in their own way. There's just beauty everywhere. Yeah. So a good hike, a great waterfall, mountains, the desert. I mean, we're in Moab, so, you know, it's delicate arch. It's beautiful. And Mesa Arch and Canyonlands. You, you just, there are so many things that you see and you think, I want to see that, I want to experience that. The adventure and the excitement and learning new things and being open-minded about what all we can do and where all we can go. We just have all of our stuff that gets to come with us. So it's not like staying in some place that we're not familiar with. We always feel comfortable because we're basically in our home that just travels with us. When we are at a place, we are here to go and see and photograph and experience. But what we have here is a means to do all that. And that's when you know the difference.